Hi guys, and welcome to another episode of Making of the Self-Affirmation Project. So, um, there's a bit of an issue. I've been using self-affirmations in my personal life as a solution to negative self-talk and was inspired to record an album titled The Self-Affirmation Project. Before now, self-affirmations are in form of spoken words that one speaks to oneself. However, my new album is a compilation of musical self-affirmations that one can sing, listen to, and even dance to. Based on my research, it will be the world's first album dedicated to self-affirmations. So, I'm determined to promote this new project and go on a new album tour with my band. Here is my story, the making of the self-affirmation project. Remember I told you a while back that the concept of the album cover involved me and a little girl. Um, but then when we got into the photo shoot, we started with that concept, um, but then the pictures weren't looking exactly how I needed them to look. Um, and I wasn't really happy with um, the, the pictures that we had taken so far. So Femi comes along as usual and made some suggestions about doing different poses and perhaps changing the concept a little bit and which is exactly what we did. So now I have two photos, one with my original concept and one with the concept that Femi suggested. And I have to admit that Femi was right. <laughs> he was right. <laughs> so now I'm going to be going with, um, yeah, Femi's concept. But I wanted to show you guys, and I'll be very appreciative if you drop your comments um, below and just let me know what you think. Right here. <laughs> that's Femi, by the way, and that's my PA, my personal assistant. Say hello. Hi. <laughs> so, yeah, they haven't, well, she hasn't seen it yet, so I want to show it to her and see what her, her natural reaction would be, whether it's, oh, wow, would you like, go with your original concept? Femi's idea sucks, which is what I hope she would say. <laughs> but then I think she's going to agree that. Um, Wishful thinking. <laughs> that my original concept was no, your, your idea sucks actually you know okay let me tell you before i show it to her and before you i unveil it to you guys the concept is this right self-affirmation and one of the things about doing affirmations is uh looking into the mirror and proclaiming these powerful statements that are things that you aspire to be so the concept that i originally had was a little girl um staring into the mirror and instead of her reflection it will be a reflection of this fierce diva staring back at her. So this fierce diva was going to be me <laughs> in the reflection, and I was going to use a little girl. But then, like I said, it didn't really turn out exactly how I had envisioned it to turn out. I'm thinking maybe I should have used a younger girl. But anyway, so now I'm going to show it to um, Rafelta, and I'll show her my concept, and I'll show her um, the... Femi's concept, <laughs> and then just say it like it is. And Femi. then she'll give her feedback, and then you guys also feel free to give your feedback. So I'm going to post the actual image so you can see clearly. But this is what it looks like on the computer screen. But I'm going to also post it um, in post production. So there's the first one. That's my concept. Mm. What? Yeah, like my makeup, that's it. Yeah, who's this? That's a supposedly little girl. So she's supposed to be looking at herself? She's supposed to be looking at herself, but then in the reflection is a fierce diva affirming herself, staring back at her. But it kind of came out messy, right? I think if you use like a three year old, yeah. Yeah. Like a cute three year old. Yeah. Like some, yeah. I know. But I like, I like the necklace. The necklace sitting down. It's okay. Yeah. Okay. I like the necklace. Yeah, the neck. Everything is still in the um. So I'll show you the new one. Yeah, we can start serving. See, I have such a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful son. Because guess what he's doing while we have, while we vlog? He's making dinner. Feed. Say hello to my people. See, he just made eba and a goosey soup. No, you have to explain what, what eba is. Oh, you guys, uh, you have to wait. You have to watch uh, subsequent episodes because I'm going to get into cooking after my album is done. <laughs> I'm going to get. We're almost done. We have a few more songs to mix. 
I'm going to start cooking and show you guys, inviting you to my kitchen. <laughs> so don't worry, I'll tell you what that is later. But it's like a, in short, it's like a Nigerian dumpling. So he's making a bag. Mm, I said Nigerian dumpling. Ah, I beg. Like Look at this boy argue with me on, on, oh, my, on camera. I'm going to cut this part off. I said it's a Nigerian, that's what they call it in America. Whenever you have dough in water, cooked in water or powder in water, it's called dumpling in America. So the only way I can use to, to explain to people is that it's an American dumpling. Oh, these American kids, they like to argue with their parents too much. Anyway, back to the purpose of today's vlog is to talk about my almond cover, not Eba, and Egusi soup, okay? Uh, or American dumplings. So anyway, let me show um, Rafelta the second one. So let me pause this so we don't have or oh, stop it. In the video, yeah. So here is you can the. Can start off as a child and then in the end you oh. wait. Are you recording already? Yeah. Okay. It's okay. You can continue. Yeah, you were making a good point. You were saying. I can't make that point on camera. <laughs> oh, I can always edit stuff out. I still want to hear what you have to say. Okay, so you can start off as a child, mm -hmm. and then especially for the animal champion, and then in the end they grow up to be this champion. <laughs> oh. Well, the first single is going to be I'm Bold. Yeah, that too. Yeah. So you can start off shy. And okay, so here okay. is... Start off, start off shy and grow up being bold. Bold. Yeah. So guys, peers and bold and I like it. You like it's, it? It's so you though. Yeah. It's playful. Yeah. Thanks to Femi. Because when Femi, you know what happened? I was minding my business on set though, my little girl doing my, you know, diva pose. And Femi was like, ah, is that the only pose you know how to do? Is that the only move you know how to make? Do uh, different things now. So I now started to do like, you were just doing anything without paying attention to, right? Yeah. And I told the guy, the, yeah, the, told the, the photographer, photographer, that's the just, best. Just snap. Just keep don't, taking. Don't wait till she poses, because usually that's how I get, you know, good, the good pictures. Yeah. Yeah, good poses from her. I just let her be herself. Just, you know, do whatever she wants, and I just snap, you know. And keep taking. There's always the mm -hmm. one that will stand out. Exactly. Yeah. And so it's always like the know. ones that you don't plan for. Yeah. Yeah, so guys, that's how come we ended up with this shot of me um, just in a state of nirvana, like, ah, self-affirmation project, buy my album, okay guys? <laughs> okay, so you like this one better? I do. Yeah. Yeah, guys, so let me know what you think. Um, leave comments below. Let me know if you like Femi's idea or... Um, my original concept but either way you know sorry guys Femi's idea wins so <laughs> I mean, it's not but, I, but really, i'm so curious to see really oh Femi's better yet idea. let me let me know if you think we should incorporate so, my original concept into the video that would be very good feedback because i don't think we should air before we shoot the video well i don't know i don't know but anyway regardless your feedback will be much appreciated um we take him with much respect so please Feel free to leave comments below. Okay, guys? Okay. Is there anything else you want to add? It's not Brad Femi's idea. Yo, it's not? Wait a minute. Did you say it's not his idea? Yeah, it's not Why? his idea. Why Be do you say that? Because he had the idea. You brought it to the table. You know, you brought the idea to life. So it's not his idea. Um, hey, yeah. <laughs> you see, the whole house is about to pounce on, on you. me. Yeah. <laughs> they already know you're anti Femi. I know. Well, how's it going? I beg, give daddy one of the pokoto. Look. Eh? Fee, is that your oh, own no, with the three an pieces an of accident. meat? Hey, <laughs> see my son. <laughs> three pieces of meat for himself, two for his father. Oh, no, hey, ah. It was an. He said it was an accident. If I didn't come to go and see now, he would have, he would have taken it. three three pieces of meat for himself, then two for his father. <laughs> All right, guys. So there it is, the cover of Self Affirmation Project. Thanks for watching. Hashtag album cover. Hashtag Self Affirmation Project. 
So we'll continue next week with another episode. See you guys. Bye. 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 <laughs> with your Eba. Are you going to show your Eba? With Absolutely not. Bye. Nope. You want a diet? <laughs> yeah. I'm a seafood diet. Hi guys, Janelia Soul here. Thanks so much for watching my vlog and please subscribe to my YouTube channel. You can subscribe by clicking the button right here. Alright guys, take care.